Well, you know, obviously it was really challenging coming down in the end. I think we're up by eight with a minute and three to go, and we fouled a, a three-point shooter, which cut it to four. And then obviously we missed, um, you know, a shot and fouled them, and they were one for two from the free throw line, so cut it to three. So, you know, pretty quickly our league got cut into. But, you know what, I, I thought that our guys' intentions, you know, that last minute in terms of our huddles and what we were talking about and what we were doing, I thought was, was, was much, much better. And actually it was really, really positive. It was good. Um, I thought we were focused on the right things. Um, I thought we had a couple possessions with like a minute 45 to go in the game where we've got to get and create more movement for Kevin and Russell because they're getting caught at the end of the clock. And that's more on me as a coach, I think, helping those other guys move correctly. But the one time coming out of a timeout, we didn't really execute what we were looking to do. And Russell, I think, got caught with the ball late, and it puts him in a difficult situation. But I thought we were much better coming down the stretch and found a way to win the game than maybe we'd been previously. I think we're really physical. And I think we know that they were uh, coming out today, not just for a quarter, the whole game, they were going to be physical. I think we, 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 we fight back, and I think we're really physical down low, and I think we did a really good job on both ends. For us, these guys gave you another battle, but y'all withstood every run and then got the stops late. How were you able to pull together when it counted in this one? Uh, I thought we did a good job executing defensively, um, got some stops, and uh, got some stops that we needed to grind the game out. Back to back with a good win for us. Yeah, second night of a back to back, and you've lost the last two here. What has this team shown on this road trip, winning all three of these? Mm -hmm. Just locking in, man. We know when we play the right way, um, we're a good basketball team, and tonight we did. Nobody has had 14 triple doubles in about 25 years. I know that you just want the win. You got the win tonight. But what do you like about the way you play on a night like this? Um, just trying to find a way to insert myself into the game, man. Some, some nights, shots won't fall for me. And I think. Uh, me and my position, I think I'm probably one of the only guys that can do different things on the floor at the time, rebound or, or pass, whatever it is, defend, whatever it is on a night in, night out basis, and that's what I'm trying to do. It seems like throughout that 14 2 run you went on, you shut off every possession with a defensive rebound. What was the key in your mind to, to making sure they only had one shot? Uh, putting bodies on them. I think when you let the team like that run around freely, they get tip ins, they get extra possessions, and tonight we, we cut that off. Coming in here, we're back to back against the team that beat us. You know, first game out of the break, and uh, it was a good win for us, especially, you know, how we fought in that uh, second half. Yeah, they played great defense, man. They went small, and they started switching everything, and that's tough. And I think we did a good job of just making plays. And we did it on our defensive end. You know, when shots not going in, the offense is a little stagnant, we got to get stops, and we did a great job of it. There's not much more to say about Russ, but six triple-doubles now in the last 11 games. It's, it's remarkable. Yeah, that's what I heard of. You know, he's just so much bigger than every point guard. He just runs in there and grabs those rebounds. He's the best offensive rebounder. Well, him and Ennis are tied for the best offensive rebounders on our team. And he does a great job of keeping basketballs alive, man. And, you know, when he got the ball in his hands, you know, he's making the right decision. 14 assists was, uh, was huge for us tonight. So, um, you know, we need to continue to be that way, continue to be confident, and, uh, you know, keep leading as a point guard.